Inside you, there's immense potential waiting to be unleashed. Balancing school, work, hobbies, friends, family, and home can be overwhelming. To truly shine and make an impact, prioritize your total well-being. When you feel your best physically and mentally, you'll have the energy and confidence to achieve your true purpose. I hate to break it to you, but the way you look plays an important role in how the world perceives you. Body positivity is all the rage right now, but let's be real. You get lethal confidence when you look your best. And obviously, looking good makes you more appealing to others. But no, I'm not saying you need to go crazy and work out 24 7 You just need to be disciplined and consistent with your workout routine. So here's a simple guide on how you can achieve your aesthetic physique. Step 1. Determine your body type. There are basically three body types. Fat, skinny, or skinny fat. When you figure out what body type you have, then you can define your goals based on that. That will help determine whether you need to bulk first and then get lean. A tactic that's often recommended for people who have a skinny body type. If you have a lot of fat, I recommend going on a calorie deficit diet with resistance training. If you're skinny fat, it's a little tricky. You lack muscle mass but carry excess body fat, typically around your belly. In this situation, lean bulking, body recomposition, and mastering your protein intake can do a lot for your progress. At the end of the day, no matter what body type you have, you need to train to build muscle mass. You can do so by actively focusing on resistance training, progressive overload, nutrition, and rest and recovery. With that out of the way, let's talk about what an aesthetic body is and how to train to achieve it. Features of an aesthetic body An aesthetic body is a body with significant muscle mass and low body fat percentage. An aesthetic body has well-defined, proportional, and symmetrical muscles. Your body type determines how lean you should get. Having an aesthetic body also means being strong yet functional, having raw strength yet still being flexible and athletic. So what does an aesthetic body look like? Broad shoulders, slim waist, broad and chiseled back, defined ab muscles, defined quads, and let's not forget calves, veins, and visible hamstrings. Basically what your favorite protagonist in any anime looks like. While anime villains are impossibly ripped, check out our video on that if that's your goal. The protagonists tend to be more balanced. Here are the specific exercises you need to do to get muscle specificity. Neck and traps. Working on your neck and traps is a crucial part of having an aesthetic body. Your neck is the most visible part of your body. A thick neck is also considered a sign of strength and dominance. But be careful not to overdo it. Balance is key. Exercises like neck curls, neck extensions, and shrugs will target these areas. When it comes to shrugs, try chest-supported wide grip shrugs and see the growth in your traps. Shoulders. Having well-defined shoulders will change your appearance drastically. When it comes to exercises, the overhead press and lateral raises build your dream shoulders. The overhead press is particularly functional, targeting various muscle groups including obliques, abs, and even the upper chest. Back. You need a broad back combined with a narrow waist to get that godly silhouette. Focus more on rowing movements to get a thick back. And a very underrated exercise that really targets your back is pull-ups. For beginners, they can be challenging at first, but just stick with it. Consistency is key. Start with bodyweight pull-ups, and once you can do several of them easily with just your body weight, you can gradually move to weighted pull-ups. Waist. There's actually a cheat to making your waist narrower. Chances are you know, but you aren't paying much attention to it. It's simply working on your shoulders and lats to get bigger, and your waist will automatically appear smaller. Now, you can't really rely on just that, so I've got another trick for you. Stomach vacuums. Not only will they strengthen your core and help remove back pain, but they can also give you the look of a smaller waist. Every morning before you eat any food or drink any water while your stomach is still empty, 
Do four to five stomach vacuums and hold for 10 to 30 seconds. First, inhale through your nose and fill your lungs. Then, after three to four seconds, exhale and at the same time, pull your stomach inside as if you're trying to touch your belly button to your spine. Upper chest. Your chest is one of the most magnetizing parts of your body. You need to have a strong defined chest to give dimension to your physique. Try adding exercises like weighted push-ups and weighted dips to your routine in addition to your usual chest exercises. If you're struggling to grow your chest, use pressing movements, especially if you're a beginner, then focus on chest flies to build a strong mind-muscle connection. Forearms. When you properly train your forearms, you'll get good vascularity and visible veins. Exercises like dumbbell reverse curls, farmer walks, and concentration curls can effectively build your forearm muscles. A B it. Going on a calorie deficit diet and doing cardio is not going to give you defined abs. Abs are also a muscle group that needs to be trained like all the other muscle groups. So focus on particular exercises that have been proven to build ab muscles and apply progressive overload to get ripped. When it comes to ab exercises, a mistake most guys make is that they choose exercises where your back is flat on the ground. You should incorporate ab exercises that lengthen and shorten the muscles so your abs actually contract. Exercises like leg raises, cable crunches, weighted crunches, Russian twists, and planks are effective and will give you the burn and the definition you need. Quads. If you can get strong, thick quads, you've won the aesthetic lottery. One key exercise that is actually very helpful is the hack squats. Not only do they target your quads, they also build your glutes, hamstrings, and even your calves. Apart from that, regular squatting movements are also helpful. Key points that can help achieve an aesthetic physique. If you're focusing on just physical exercise to help you achieve an aesthetic body, you might get there, but it'll take you longer and you might not reach your true potential. So here are some keys that you should definitely pay attention to, because trust me, it'll really help in achieving your dream body. Work on your mental health. A healthy mind equals a better workout. When your mind is in a good place, you're more energized to work out and you'll be more disciplined with your workouts and your diet. At the end of the day, it's important to work out in a way that fits your goals and your lifestyle so that you're more prone to stay consistent. Let me know if you have any other tips. Don't forget to watch the other videos on my channel to become the best version of yourself. I'll see you in my next video.